Count and record respirations. This skill is used to measure the respiratory rate and is part of the physical assessment. If performed incorrectly, it can cause medication errors, serious illness, and even death. You will have one and a half to two and a half minutes to complete this skill. You will need a watch with a second hand. I'm Nicole, going to be your caregiver today. Let me just check your wristband. I'm just going to check your respiration. So we're going to watch your chest walking down for a full minute. Is that okay? Okay. So I'm going to go ahead and put the bed up a little bit. I'm just going to raise the head of your bed up a little bit so we can see your chest walking down a little bit better. So here's the bed's going up. There's no privacy on this skill. It's optional unless the patient requests it. So I'm gonna go ahead and, um, and wash my hands and I'll be right back. So even though we don't touch the patient, we still have to wash our hands. So we simulate the state. We come back in. And just for the purposes of the video, I'm gonna um, pull the blanket down so we all can see. Watch Miss Kanisha's chest go up and down. So every time the chest rises is when you count. So it goes up and it goes down. So every time it goes up, you count another one. Okay, this is my proctor. She's gonna assist me to confirm the results. I'm gonna count it for one full minute, so if you can just close your eyes and just relax. Are you ready? Mm -hmm. Go. Okay, I have 12, what did you get? 12. So me and the proctor both got the same number. Um, you can be off by two points on respirations and we were um, identical with our reading. So I'm gonna go, go ahead and cover our patient back up so she's not exposed, keep her warm and comfortable. Okay, Ms. Kanisha, thank you. Um, your respirations were 12, nice and even. I'm gonna go ahead and put your bed down, back to your lowest position. Would you like to keep the head of your bed up or you want me to um, put it back down? Yeah. Okay, let me know when. Okay. Okay, so make sure you have your call light. Here's your call light, just in case you need to get in touch with me. Is there anything I can do for you before I leave? Okay, thank you. Um, wash my hands and document 12 respirations and the skill is complete.